Long, long ago, at the dawn of 3D CAD, two technologies emerged that allowed us to turn our creative thoughts into innovative products more easily. Facet modeling represented surfaces as connected planar triangles, and surfaces were positioned to represent 3D objects. It was favored for its simplicity and ease of coding, but engineering accuracy required very large datasets. Boundary representation, BREP, used mathematically defined surfaces connected by topology to represent objects as watertight volumes. This was concise and precise, but also more complex. BREP proved the best solution for engineering, and today, the vast majority of CAD CAM systems for design, simulation, and manufacture of consumer and industrial products are BREP based. Facet modeling developed as the preferred solution for less precise, high-speed shape representation, such as gaming, animation, and digital mock-up. Recently, facet data has become more common and more valuable in engineering workflows, with the emergence of high-precision, low-cost 3D scanning, medical scanning, and 3D printing. But the benefits of using facet data are reduced by the need for one-way, one-time conversion to BREP format which is often time-consuming and error-prone for numerous technical reasons. The ideal but extremely difficult technical solution is to fully integrate facet data representation into a BREP system's architecture, so facet data can be used for all operations without conversion, as if it is BREP data. Siemens PLM has developed this groundbreaking solution and calls it convergent modeling. Use facet data in your BREP workflows with no data conversion and all the benefits of both technologies. Take a look into convergent modeling and take your innovation to a whole new level.